out. Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Nordic 4-digit Catch Cup. I am Hypnospira, and I am joined by Jürgen. Hello, hello, hello. Back again at it. Let's go. Absolutely we are. Today we have Shukas versus Miku starting off the quarterfinals in the loser bracket here. Uh, I think this should be a good match. I think it should be good. Uh, looking at like the previous rounds, uh, both of them won 5-1 to one against uh, uh, their other opponent. Um, I didn't really get too much time to prep. I have no idea what they're good at. Miku is pretty good at hidden, right? Yeah, Miku's a hidden, a hidden main, uh, but also plays easy double time. So a little bit of double time. Granted, it is di very different to play with easy compared to no mod. Yeah, it looks like Miku's definitely got Chukas on uh, hidden, but there's only two seats. Like it's only one between them in seating, so it should be really close, I think. Should definitely be close, and it is interesting that Miku does have the advantage on hidden um, because that tends to mean that it's never a sweep. Right. Yeah. Uh, which will mean that uh, we'll be here for, let's see, I think we'll be here for 45 minutes. Uh, I'm calling a tiebreaker this time. And this Ooh, time I think nice. I'm actually right, unlike yesterday. And uh, this is a tiebreaker that we definitely want to see because, uh, you know, for anyone who knows me, I like Toho. And it's a Toho tiebreaker. And the song is very good. <laughs> I want to see tiebreaker <laughs> in every match. That's what you said. Yeah. 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 Oh, we actually. see uh, we see a classic in the uh, in the warm up here. Oh, classic indeed! Like old school, I'd say. Yeah, call me maybe nightcore mix with hidden, as we see Miku play with. This takes me back. I believe it's in the AR eight. Was, this was yes, Matt uh, before they even got like uh, decimals on the stats. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, really so uh, yeah, on stream it says it's uh, HDHR by Bill Yamoto, that is not the song they're playing. I can confirm that. Call it by Jepson. Call it maybe. Yeah, we see a Miku with a little bit of a lead on this form up here. Um, I must say I'm impressed that... I know Miku is a hidden main, but I'm still impressed that he is keeping a score advantage against Shukas with hidden on a map like this. Uh, being a hidden main, this is like really up his alley, I think. Shukas might be more of an, an all modder, all modder. So yeah, I think we'll uh, maybe see Shukas uh, playing well on the high AR uh, maps. Very well be the case. Um, let me check the stats from last round again, see if I find Shukas. Yeah, Shukas struggling a little bit on the uh, Nomads that weren't very conventional. Um, but... Doing... Relatively well... On... What class did they play? Yeah, I was looking at the stats of the uh, round of 16. Actually, Shukas did decently on Hidden. Well, that was, that was on Hidden too. Gone. But, yeah. 623,630,000 on the warm up, um, even though they didn't use the same mods. But I think yeah, yeah. it's going to be very, very equal. No we see Shuka's rolling a 100. By the way, <laughs> that is hard to beat. <laughs> <laughs> that that is hard to beat. What did, you, what did you say last time? He practiced those rolls. Yeah, I mean you have to practice the rolls, and we see Miku. I mean Miku's practice wouldn't have paid off no matter how hard they practiced. Beating a hundred is just impossible. You can tie it, you can't beat it. You could, uh, what if they tied it? Would... Then they roll again, I think. Yeah, that would make more sense, but is that really the most fun? No. I, uh, I, I want do, a... Um, yeah, what are you saying? No, no. I said the referee should just ban two maps. Yeah, I agree. I agree. And pick the first map. 
And oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> Uh, we see Shuka. By the way, we see Shuka's batting hidden three, the uh, low AR uh, convert. Is it low AR too? Yeah, oh, it is. A ARA. Um, and which Miku's not going to be happy to see. There's still two hidden maps for him to win on. There is indeed, and we uh, see Miku batting DT1. But, but the banger, it's Batman. I know, I know, I know. Um, but what I was going to say is I want to see a tournament where it, the rolls work the same as any other tournament, but if a player rolls a 69, then they just win the rolls. <laughs> a 69 <laughs> is basically a 100. It's a 101. <laughs> yes. Um, yeah, I can agree with that. Everything else about the tournament, nothing is different. Except for that. <laughs> this is such a random move change. <laughs> you ever see Mika picking hit in one, by the way? I don't think anyone is surprised. Uh, no, I, I could call that. I, I would bet money on that. I also would. And we, we see Shuka saying, uh, I might not have played hit in one. Troll face emoji. For emote, so uh, that's uh, let's see how this goes as we get into colorful, col colorful, precious life. Guess we'll see who uh, who's the most colorful after the map is done. I I see what you did there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We see both them actually. Only Miku missed at the start there. Definitely didn't see that coming. Uh, I thought the first one could go to Shuka's. I did as well. Now granted, there is still um, about three minutes left of the map, so nothing is decided yet. Could be very close. Yeah, we see Shuka signing <laughs> a miss there. And it's gonna flip over to Miku. We do see Shukas with uh, with an accu accuracy advantage here. Somehow, we might have uh, practiced this. Yeah, might have been doing a bit of mind games by saying that they haven't played it. Maybe you could have done the same with on double time. That is true. That is true. They're definitely playing uh, better than I thought it would. I thought it would be uh, a close score like uh, throughout the match, but I thought like each map wouldn't be as close as they are. Yeah, we do see Shuka's finding another miss there, and Miku holding on st still. We might see a 100k difference at the end. Yeah, right now it's roughly 50k. That combo is very strong for Miku. Yeah, Shukas finds another miss. Miku's gonna drop that combo though, as you pointed out how good it was. I think, <laughs> I, think I need to commentate more tournaments because I've, I, I, I'm i getting a god complex, I think. <laughs> I just have the power. Yeah, welcome to the club. That's, that's how it feels a lot of the time. Uh, now we do see Shukas with a bit of a combo advantage. And the Don't score no, 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 slightly. <laughs> It's slightly thicken over. I mean, I still have to comment it. Um... <laughs> it's hard to do our <laughs> job without feeling guilty. Uh, I didn't curse Shukas, in fact, because they are still holding on to that combo. Um, <laughs> Miku <laughs> finds a drop. Oh, no, the, the, no, the trade. <laughs> and the score is going to stay in favor of Miku. Um, I had a hard combo as well. Yeah, oh Shuka's gonna Shuka's gonna have to hold on to some consistency here, and Miku's gonna have to drop quite a bit, but Shuka's is gonna find that miss instead. Guess very silent. Oh, trading! They do trade. And as we know, trades always favor whoever's in the lead. Yeah, Shuka's has the higher combo though. Uh, <laughs> that's By like three. <laughs> yeah, it's not enough. Uh, Miku needs one more miss. 
the wrong medium. Yeah, we see Shuka Shuka finding him this, just as we said he needed the final one. Um, and uh, we're gonna approach the end of the map. Miku does find a miss there, and another one. I don't think that alone is gonna be enough though. Gonna have to see more. It's just not enough notes left. In fact, you are correct, as Miku's gonna take the first point of the match. Probably not as comfortable as he would want it though. But uh, it's, as we expect, it's seed 13 versus 15. It's gonna be close. It is definitely going to be close. And it's interesting to see, does Shukas go into the double time pool seeing that Miku banned it? Or will Shukas go towards something else? Well, if I was Shukas, knowing Miku being a hidden main, I, I would go into hit Nomad. That is a very fair point, but we do see Shukas going into double time too, the Atarashigako banger. It, 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 it's definitely a song. It's a very good song, in fact. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good man. I, uh, I hope for your sake that Ash is in here, because uh, there's no bigger Atoshi Gakko fan than, uh, than Ash Ketchum. Make sure he doesn't watch this VOD back, because I'm gonna get fired. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not bad. I didn't say it was bad. That is true. That is true. You live another day. That's what does have a point though. Just remove the double time. I song. think it's a good song with DC. I also like think it's a good song, song with Nightcore. Maybe it's even better if you're like, it's double time, but it's actual double time, so it's not 1.5 instead of it's 2 points. Or, yeah, 2 times. Yeah, that's how double time should be. It really is. <laughs> but a lot of things would be, uh, be unplayable. That is true. That is true. We get into the map early, here. Early shit miss from Miku. It doesn't look like it. They're finding another miss there. Early doors to see Shuka's holding off the full combo, never mind. Um, I'm to see Miku not uh, opting for hidden. Yeah, me too. I thought he was uh, hidden around he could kind of player. Yeah, as far as I'm aware, that's what they've been, as they find a couple more misses there. He's struggling a lot more than Shukas at this point. He's been quite consistent. Only I've only seen one miss from him so far. Three. There's the second one. Um... <laughs> There's a trade. It's okay. There's a trade. I have to get to the halfway mark. Shukas has a slight lead. Uh, yeah. miss it, so he's gonna get even bigger now. Yeah, we see Chukas running away with the score a little bit on this map. Not gonna be as close as Hidden 1, it seems. He's gonna find a miss there, though. The lead is so huge though, right? it's, it's gonna need to disconnect or something to make it to come back, I think. Yeah, I, I know I make this joke all the time, but Nora's gonna have to like sink to the bottom of the ocean or something. Yeah. For the <laughs> score to uh, go Miku's way. Or disconnect the service from Banjo. Sinking to the bottom of the ocean would do that, I think. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> And yeah, we see Shuka's taking the point, making it one to one. And Miku's getting their own pick here. Cannot go back to hidden just I yet. I must say, quite comfortably. Uh, double the combo, uh, four misses, I guess, 17. Yeah. Uh, this will hurt Miku's uh, instincts or morale. Could very well do so. No one incoming, I can't. I can sense it. I think it would be Shuka another, saying, uh, Shuka saying, what is it with me and playing against people not on their own setup? That is true, Miku is in Norway right now. Uh, and their last match, I think it was Kubex they were playing against, were, were not in Sweden either, were not at home. Yeah. 
it is interesting to see what Miku is gonna gonna pick here. No Matu. BB caps. It's gonna be another match with a few hard drops, I think. I would be inclined to agree. Another Blink in the map. Quite a row now. Yeah. Not gonna complain though, I think Rinky and I are very fun to play a lot of the time. Rinky on map is uh Rinky is an underrated mapper, I think. Uh, like every map that they make is just fantastically well made. I completely agree. Completely agree. We get underway, Nomad too. A little bit of a tricky Nomad, as Nomad 2 usually is. You see Miku finding an early miss. The sugar's gonna trade those a little bit later. Getting one additional miss. Every, every miss on this map is so precious too. Because it, uh, so the note is just very dense, I guess. The map isn't that Yeah, that is true. That is so. true. Can we see both players. Yeah, you're completely right. We see both players struggling a little bit. Sugar's having a slight combo lead, but they are get, which they are going to see at the break. I think that spinner is hard. That was definitely a hard one. Um, not that I think it matched with these scores, but Sugar's got the better spinner on that one. Yes, indeed. And we see Sugar's having such a slight lead. Oh, and he's gonna find a miss there. Switching it over to Miku. Reeling in points. Yes, indeed, and Shuka's gonna find another miss there. So Miku's gonna find one of their own. Could be very close at the end. Oh, but Shuka's gonna find a miss there. It's not gonna help at all. That's the dagger. It is indeed, and Mika's gonna take it two to one. So far, they know what to pick. Yeah, the picks have been good from each player. This is very, very, very close. Uh, Sugus might want to consider Hard Rock instead of picking a Nomad here. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Yeah, they go into hard rock too. Black or white by Black Yo versus Sirumaru. Classic. That song. Absolute classic. You're just picking hard rock too, then saying this is gonna be scuffed. <laughs> maybe just hoping to outscore despite maybe not being super comfortable. I've, done, I've gone for that strat before in tournaments. What, pick something you're both bad at? Yeah, and hoping you're less bad than your opponent. <laughs> it's a... Uh, out of um, miss your opponent. Exactly. It's definitely a strat, but it doesn't always work out. We'll see. The one time I tried it, it worked out. But we'll see if it works out for Shuka's here. You can go with Hidden yeah. on hard rock now. Yeah, Hidden can make AR-10 or higher AR in general feel a little bit easier to read. I think so. I don't know, I can understand some things. Now we see Shuka's finding an early miss there. Miku missing there. Quite a bit, actually. Yukus is not going to take advantage of that, of those misses. It's so weird to see because Miku seemed to be uh, somewhat in control of the map before the miss. Yeah. And now they're talking about it, just 
missing constantly. I'm sorry, Mickey. Don't worry about what I'm saying. Just play. The <laughs> Turn off the stream in the background. Turn off the stream. But you know, we see Sugar's holding on to a little bit of a combo here now, and it's gonna lose that. I'm sorry, Shukas. Um Gets the lead though with a slight combo advantage. Yes, indeed. Because you're getting into the second break. And they're gonna see the, the score advantage and combo advantage. It's fun to see the new generation of players. I agree. It's just fun to see what they can do and think about what they might be able to achieve later on. Both players have been, uh, reached the, the 100 combo mark on this map, but none of them could do it on the combo maybe warm up. Yeah. They are 8. Just skill difference, I guess. Uh, <laughs> but we see Shuka's taking the point, making it 2 to 2. Um, Neither player breaching the 750,000 score, but Shukas is not going to care as they still won by almost 100,000. Point is a point. A point is a point. Fin 2 incoming. I'm guessing. Yeah, I, that is what I'm predicting as well. We see Miku saying at least better than my practice run, so they did PB. It's something. It's always nice to do. Yeah, and you are 100% right, Mika going straight to Hidden 2. But it's best of 11 now, so... Um, I, hang on, Hidden 2... He's oh, gotta pick something he doesn't want to play. If they keep tying up like this. Yeah, eventually. This is a scary hidden map, in my opinion. It's very easy to just chain miss on this. Trust the uh, both players have been practicing it. You can see early Miku miss, finding a yeah, very early miss. Bashuka's gonna find that one. Swinging the lead over to Miku. Miku's gonna find a miss there though. The Sugars can hold on. Yeah, especially with that miss again from Miku, could switch over. Gonna do just that. Granted, ever so slightly. Slides like that. Uh, yeah, it's a hard map to double S. Just like you say. I think it's hard to actually a full combo. Yes, as I mentioned, it's very easy to just miss on this, especially chain missing is uh, not unlikely. Oh, we see both ready. players. Nice. Yeah, both players missing that hyper. And Chukas is holding on pretty strong here. On Miku's pick. Yeah, it's not looking good for the Swede. It not at all. There's still a little bit less than half the map though, so it is not over. Both press holding on here. Yeah, maybe it's definitely thinking miss, miss, miss. No, uh, not like you're done. Yeah, the Mika's gonna find a few. Shukas is gonna miss as well, but Mika's gonna have to hope for more and to find some consistency on this. Uh, I bet this is not Mika's best run. No, I, uh, I can, yeah, I cannot imagine Mika being happy with this run. And 
definitely not see this coming. I, I thought that if there was uh, one mod pool on this map, well, it, where uh, one would definitely like just destroy the other player, it would be me going ahead. Yeah, I completely agree. But we see Shook is taking the first break point of the match, making it three to two. And Shuk is asking if Miku banned it double time one. <laughs> Shuk is going to destroy Miku. <laughs> no mercy. You ban DT1, I pick it anyway. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> now we see Shuk is going to double time three. I believe the character in the background of this map is from Sonar Online. I haven't watched that show though, so. Uh, from the Sonar Online movie, if I'm not mistaken. Ah, okay. And through Sonar Online fashion, the movie is so so. That's fair. That is very fair. And we are getting into it here. I like the song though. Oh yeah, the, the song is really good. Oh, did some people getting a little bit of a head start? She was finding an early miss. I think you're gonna overdash that a little bit. I need a miss. Should just find another miss. Picking it very close. And you can missing on those quick little left rights. It should be a bit late in dashing. A little bit, and if you're used to sort of lowering our head in like Miku is, then a map like this could be a little bit uncomfortable to play. Yeah, I think so too. I'm not sure how much he plays double time at all. It's mostly with easy double time. When he does play double time. And as I mentioned earlier, playing easy double time is very different to just playing double time. It's another beast, yeah. Oh, players, like, Shook is missing, you're like, giving Miku small slivers of hope. Um, just to have a Miku, Miku just that cannot say, yeah, Miku just cannot take advantage of that. It might be that, um, the team not being on his original setup is uh, actually what's going in this match. That could very well be the case. Yeah, I, I can't see Miku having... Uh, not having better side control at home. Or better control home. Yeah. It's, just, uh, it's a shame we can't like, watch them play at their best. Yeah, you always want to see players perform as well as they can. But in tournaments it's always going to be hard to see. That's true. Especially in a tournament like this where a lot of players are new to tournaments. Sugar's finding a couple of misses, but it's still showing a lot more comfort on this than what Miku is. And it's gonna take the point, making it 4 to 2. But it's still not over. It's not best of 9 after all, like the previous rounds. Exactly. You do get one more pick. It's gonna go into Nomad 1, the consistency map. 
You got eleven number one. Yeah, one of two custom maps for this pool. So shout out to Wang Wang for mapping this. Can you please pronounce a difficult name for me, please? <laughs> yeah, that seems great. Yeah, it's just the it's just the chorus. Oh. That makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> I never noticed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, as we get into it here, into this VTuber map. Only miss from true guess. It is early doors though. Granted, this is a little bit of a shorter Nomad 1 than what you might see. I might be used to seeing, I should say, as Miku finding a few misses. Miku's gonna find a miss there. Miku holding onto a combo. It's gonna slowly tick towards Miku now. Yeah, we'll definitely see Miku lead. Never mind, do not see Miku lead. <laughs> I was gonna say we'll see him lead um, as long as he keeps combo, but I could not manage to do that. Sure, he's gonna find a miss there though. So we'll see if we can hold on to combo this time. Yes, as it takes over right there, Shuka finding another miss. Not got the name. It really is not. It's got some breathing room now, now with that 4 2 lead. It's never good to listen that. Yeah, we see both players missing that little bit of a snappy, uh, snappy jump. Resetting the combo. But Mika's gonna find a miss. So there's an ever so slight score lead to Shukas. Or combo lead, sorry. Yeah, they do trade. It's gonna really? keep it in Miku's favor. Yeah. It's gonna build it even bigger. Yeah, both players trading again. Hello, Ash. Welcome to this match, as we see both players trading once again. Yeah, they seem to be missing on the same place there. Uh, it's, a, it's a lead, it's not a comp No, I should have missing just before the break. The Mika finding a miss there. Should be safe as long as the two misses every time they do. Yeah, and they seem to be doing so. So, but it close is close not. Game. Yeah, it is such a close. Yeah, it's so close. Two having a slight combo lead at the end, but it's gonna find a miss. And another one there. And that is gonna be. 4-3 to, to Shukas, Miku taking the point. Good job, Miku. We'll see another hard rock. Um, I'm, I'm very good at pattern recognition, so I'm assuming hard rock. You are correct, it is hard rock one. The next custom map in the pool, also mapped by Wang Wang. My IQ is just 190. You're just so smart. The I biggest am. brain in the room. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not only smart, but wise. Exactly. But yeah, another shout out to Wang Wang is in order. Thank you for custom mapping and thank you to everyone working on this tournament. I see a little bit of Jonas Brothers. It's almost too bad it's not match point. In case Shukas wanted, because then Miku would be the sucker. 
But I, I can't really <laughs> use stun. I can't not manage at this moment. <laughs> you could have just waited until one of them lost and just say that that person was the sucker. It's coming. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> We're making the joke anyway. Yeah. Stay yeah, tuned, folks. Stay tuned. <laughs> <laughs> They'll never see it coming. <laughs> You'll be blindsided by, by whatever joke is coming up towards the end of the map. Anyway, we will get into it here. Again, you can find your early misses. He's been consistently doing it on every map, I think. Yeah, it's gonna have a slight combo lead now, though. It's gonna take a slight lead here. I kinda missed there though, I was gonna go back to Shuka's. Wait, did we also mention that this is, that this is a custom map of Hard Rock? Uh, how, how, how can you make a custom map of Hard Rock? That's insane. Yeah, it's very impressive. Yeah, we see Shuka's holding a score lead, but it's... Now having a combo lead. And the score lead is gonna increase ever so slightly. Yeah, Mika finding a few more misses. Shuk is again just showing a little bit of a higher comfortability on, on this map. Higher comfort? I don't think you would use the word comfortability in that situation. Anyway, this isn't an English lesson. A lot of big jumps in this map. Like, I can understand the misses. I know where they're coming from. Yeah, yeah. It's uh, it is an easy map to miss on because of those, because of the spacings in the map. But it's relatively low BPM too. One thirty-eight. Yeah, it's not the fastest song. But I still think the song fits a consistency hard rock map. Because this map is just a lot of hard rock consistency. And we do see Shuka's holding on to the lead. Mika being down around a B rank. I must hurt. I, I, I know what it feels like you just miss on stuff you shouldn't be missing on and you know it matters so much and you, you can't like yeah. quit or retry or anything exactly miku might just be hoping that the map is over soon as shugas is holding a significant lead on this it is indeed as we approach the end of the map. I'm a sucker for you. Training on the same is three times. Um, so it's definitely, um, uh, well, how should I say it eloquently? Skill issue from both sides. Yeah, you are correct. We do see Shukas taking the point. We've seen that Shukas was not the sucker choosing this but, map. There we go. There we go. It would have been um, better if it won. Uh, I'll come back stronger next time. Yeah, I'm expecting better later on. <laughs> Me but too, almost late. <laughs> <laughs> we do see Shuka's taking the match point here, and Miku saying, "Oh man, hard rock and sixty hertz. Sixty hertz makes it extra hard. Hurts. Sorry, not hearts. Um, and yeah, hard rock on sixty hertz. Not ideal conditions to play in." Um, but yeah, Miku can't go back to Nomad, and all the hiddens are gone, so it's Hard Rock 3, double time, 3. Yes. Yes. No. No, not double time 3, that's been played already. Uh, hard Rock yeah. 3. Yeah, it's Hard Rock 3, because they Tom cannot three. go back to Nomad. There's no other choice. Well, can't complain about that. It's NTU after all. But technically, you can't pick on a match point against him. Yeah, 
You, you, you gotta feel for the guy. Yeah, there's not much you can do. But, we do get to see a banger. It is one of my favorite MTU songs, actually. They're all so good. Yeah, I'm glad they're one of them, because in just just like you say, it is hard to choose. I do think Promise is my favorite, though. If I had to choose. Oh, Master is very good. Yeah, we're getting underway. Sugar's holding on to a full combo in the first, uh... In the first 69 combo, and uh, Miku finding a couple misses before it. Shuka can find a miss with a trade there, keeping the lead in Shuka's favor. Are finding another miss? I'm not comfortable with the common hard rock. Indeed, now. E even less so than the specifics, at least. Yeah, they are gonna trade again there, but Miku just keeps on finding more misses than what Shuka's is. This is short, too. Miku's about a we can't afford any more misses. I was gonna find a bunch there earlier, yeah. And then finding another one now. The Miku's gonna have a combo disadvantage and a score disadvantage. Not anymore. Every time. Yeah. Just par for the course at this point. Here we see Chuka's holding on to a score lead. These patterns are hard, especially if you're not used to combos or hard rock. As the end of this map gets a little bit brutal. Yeah, there was just no coming back. Every time Shuka's men missed, so did Miku. Uh, it wasn't the other way around, unfortunately. Unfortunate. But we're going to see Shuka's moving on to their next match. Which is going to be against Lanky or the Lanky loser. Laddie. Yeah, the loser between Waffle Laddie or Lanky. That could get very, spicy. It definitely could. And we will say goodbye to Miku, but they should definitely be proud of how they played, I think. Yeah, I think so too. 6-3 uh, uh, on a computer that you haven't played on before. Uh, definitely a good score. Absolutely, and getting this far in the tournament is like that alone. It's an achievement on its own. It really is. So, very well played and good game to Miku and good luck to Shukas in their next match, which I think is going to be on Sunday. Till tomorrow. We shall see him again in not too long. Yes, indeed. Yes.